Well, here we are, and we are going to try and break free. Break, break free, free escapes. Yes. And uh, yeah, Kelly and I are here, and ladies, I just got to say, this is going to be an incredible time, and we're going to need your help. Yes. So just <laughs> make sure you don't take your earpiece out because we have a hard time doing this. So and uh, this place is huge. It, so, massive. Yeah, it's, massive. It's massive. So I just love it. Wait. I see him chewing on his finger. What are you thinking? <laughs> okay. Are you already making fun of us? Kelsey's already in the background. I think he is. <laughs> I think he is. Oh my goodness. Because well, we're alone. It's yeah. going to be. Are, is anybody helping us? Is it just the two of us? We're here for you. Well, we got some help here. Yeah, yeah. Maybe. Maybe. He's been here a while. <laughs> He's obviously like, been here. He, he, like he might be a little bit smarter than we are. Like the bag of Doritos, bit. anything for this guy? I mean, Polly wants a cracker and then some. But, but yeah, but ladies, this is something that I, I seem to think it is blowing up everywhere. People mm -hmm. love doing these escape rooms. Now, how did you guys get started? I went to one in Florida. I was a big puzzle geek and mm -hmm. they didn't have any in the area and I went to Florida and I went to some um, there and and uh, so excited, loved it. So I came back here and mm -hmm. made one and it was the first one in the area and uh, wow. most people even now still don't know what an escape room is. You make it sound so easy. I just made one. <laughs> 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 I just pop it out of here. I mean, how did you, I mean, was it easy to put together and did, did you come up with the themes yourself? Mm -hmm. You did. I, I did and it's kind of funny when you look back, it was like I was making escape rooms for my kids' birthday parties. Okay. You know, it was like, oh yeah, well, that's what that was. So, so. you had a gift for it and a flair for it. And I was a teacher, elementary teacher for 25 years, oh. so. And if you I, make the room good enough, it's also nap time for you. Yes. Yeah, here, no, kids, no, no. Work your way out of this. No, I no, no. Two hours, just I go yeah. right now and take a nap. Just don't take a nap when we're in the room together <laughs> yeah. and try to leave me all by myself. Just don't do that. Oh, well, I was gonna just check out since so we checked in. <laughs> and then Donna, what? how did you get started? My son knew that I liked things like this, so mm -hmm. he got me a, an, a gift certificate for the one in Fort Wayne, because there wasn't one up here yet. And I did just one and came back and said, I'm going to make one of these. Uh, she opened while I was working on mine. So mm -hmm. we were just opened a few months from each other and uh, just made it. And same thing as her. I always made scavenger hunts and that kind of thing for my kids when they were little. So it just felt very natural to do this. And then you guys came together. Mm -hmm. yeah. We did. This is great. And now you have this place break. It's huge. Now, mm -hmm. how big is this place? No idea. Yeah, no, I, it's I, a I, I could get lost in here. <laughs> no, we could definitely no, no, really. Get lost have in you here. had anybody come do this and then you, they've disappeared? No, nope, no. Just this guy. Okay, okay. Yeah. I just want to make you sure. You can see how long he's been here. <laughs> yeah. so well, it had to be time. big because it can host up to 40 people. And mm -hmm. that's fun yeah. because some of the escape rooms, you know, they, you can maybe host eight to 10 mm -hmm. or 12, but this you can host 40. So, I mean, yeah. you can have a huge group of people. Mm -hmm. Well, they got yeah. it where they can come in and sit down, they can do catered meals, all mm -hmm. this stuff is here. So, yeah. You kind of got it all covered, right? Yeah. Yes. Well, tell us about some of the escape rooms that are here. All right. Well, uh, one we have right now that's fairly new is called Escape the Comic Book. And uh, mm -hmm. you start out in the villain's lair and you're trying to rebuild a transporter to get back into the real world. And it has some really fun elements, um, some kind of lighthearted elements that have to do with classic comic book things and classic villain things. It's very family friendly. Okay. Um, are the clues so. easy or are they really hard? Uh, we, I just I'd, say know. This one, oh, yeah. I'd say this one is medium. You medium. said it's family okay. friendly, but then it's she and I working on this alone together. It's not going to be family friendly. It's not going to be easy. Yeah, you know, you know, you know the cartoons that go beat. kaboom and the bam and you see all yeah. of that. It might happen in there. Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Never know. That, I'm yeah. sure it will. No, but okay, so medium, right? So mm -hmm. how many people about that have gone in there, the percentage, how many made it out? I'd say Would it's a say? fairly high percentage, okay. um, but as Clue Masters, we're here to support you to make sure you have a good time. So yes. we don't want to let anybody stay there, you know, just right. floundering right. for too so long. So we're not allowed to use our superpowers to get out. We have to <laughs> you, just... You could try. We okay. I'd like to see that. Okay. But it's a right. kryptonite-proof room, right? So yes. you, can't, you, you just <laughs> yes. can't do that, right? Yes. But then you also have this fun pirate-themed mm -hmm. one, yeah. and that's pretty unique because there's different crates, so you guys can see all these different crates around yeah. here. So how do you use that within that particular escape room? Well, in this one, it's structured a little bit differently mm -hmm. in that um, it can be done by two people or 40 people. So you have to go around to each crate and you solve them in any order. And then okay. once you have all 12 solved, then you have what you need to open this final crate. You're trying to steal back a treasure that's been stolen from you. Yes, and how long do you have on each of them? An hour. An hour? Mm -hmm. Okay, and then you guys are also doing a really fun one. 
where you get to use your phone and it's an app and you're actually partnering with a museum. Mm -hmm. Can you guys tell us a little bit about it? Sure, you want to yeah. talk about that one? Uh, it's in the uh, Bristol Museum, mm -hmm. um, Elkar County Historical Museum in Bristol on Vistula Street 120 in Bristol. And you use your phone and you download an app and you're going to use the different artifacts in the museum to solve puzzles to reach a final goal. After you've finished all the puzzles in there, then you have to figure out who the grandmother of the curator is. That's your final Ooh. goal. Ooh. Almost Very like cool. a clue. Great. A little bit, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I love the fact that we're actually here and we get to do this. And it, do we get more than an hour? We'll probably need it, <laughs> just to be honest with you. We're, we're here and for I you. Should probably, here. Call, we're here for I should here. probably call my wife and tell her <laughs> I'm gonna be late. Okay, you guys are not helping us at all, by the way. And um, we need all the help that we yes. can get. But we made it into we made the it other into the room. room. I don't know how we did it, but we did. I had a leather man. We had a lot of help. All right, yeah. let's head in there. Well, you know, sometimes we can work things, and we didn't have to wear our, our, our superhero outfits. Our superhero, outfits no, because we just had effects. our superhero hero stuff going on without the costume. We were super duper. Yeah, we were. We were like Wonder Twins unite. Super duper we, yes. fly and free. Yes, So there yes. you go. But thank you, yeah. ladies. That it was, was so a lot much of fun. fun. And, uh, yeah, Great place to, to bring the family. People. Yes, about 40, yeah, 45 Yeah, you could take 45 people, people into that A lot of different things to do. So, yeah, you definitely yeah. want to take your family. There's a lot of fun. Good team building skills. Be patient while you're in there. Don't panic. Because we did almost have like a panic room for a minute. Did we? Yeah. No. Well, oh yeah. Well, no, you almost fell asleep. You you tried to go to sleep on me, but happen. we made it out, and that's the it best thing. Possible. It wasn't boring. Yes, that's I just right. Just needed to refresh my memory. Yes. Well, let me refresh your memory. Go do you ahead. remember when we went to Crasal Arts Center yeah. last year? Do you remember we were on near the beach looking at the sculptures, and it was yes. really cold and snowy and beautiful. all that, but it was beautiful. Well, we're yes. going to take a look at another really cool, beautiful sculpture, minus the snow this time. Oh, let's do it.